Well, 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 motherfuckers. I anticipated this. I predetermined this. I knew it was going to happen. I said it on my um my channel. My second channel. The second that they... Uh, what the fuck they did. The second they uh, gave me that second warning strike for bullshit. Um, I said my channel may get taken down. I gave everybody a warning on my main channel. And guess what fucking happened? My channel got fucking taken down. So, yeah. Um, the worst part about all of this is I had a lot of memorable videos on that channel. I had so much shit. And they just took it all away. They don't give me the option to re-download all of my videos again. So I can keep it as storage to remember, okay, I did this in this past part of my life. No, they don't give a fuck. YouTube's like, nah, just fuck you. You're gonna just take it all down. You won't ever see it again. Fuck you. Okay. Um, that's great. So, meanwhile, they demolish my YouTube channel over fucking bullshit claims that have not even been verified. Meanwhile, we got douchebags like Woody's fucking gamertag still on the internet. We got people like him still making videos. I don't know, man. This is ridiculous. There's so many other people that leave the most bigoted hate speech on YouTube. And they target me as if I'm some fucking horrible bad guy. They targeted my first video over Grand Theft Auto. Me, let me just know, all of this is just video game stuff. None of this is actual real stuff. This is just shapes and fucking figures going on. None of this is actual people. They're targeting me over a video game. Grand Theft Auto. The player was in the little strip club area and apparently YouTube slapped me on the face for that. And then like me playing a video game of a Grand Theft Auto player in a strip club. Even though there's tons of videos already on YouTube of people doing the exact same thing I had uploaded. But nah, fuck me, right? Those guys are not the bad guys. I'm the fucking bad guy. That was the first strike. Second strike was over the most petty bullshit fucking ridiculous claim I've ever heard. They called me a homophobe, pretty much. They said, you have a video that contains hate speech. Fucking hate speech. It was a video of me talking about a gay guy giving oral sex on a television show and nowhere within those what five minutes within those five minutes in nowhere of that video did I say anything hate speech it was BS the only fucking thing I said on that video was why are you giving oral sex on live television there was no fucking hint anywhere in that video that I gave hate speech YouTube have fucking monkeys running their stupid website. Google doesn't ought to fucking cooperate well with YouTube. Their YouTube site is so shit. It's ridiculous. I, I can't wait to fucking come in and replace with YouTube. I got a fucking Elgato HD capture card, and I'm not letting it go to waste. I'm not fucking selling it on eBay. I'm gonna fucking use it. So they're gonna have to deal with me whether they like it or not. Meanwhile, while they're dealing with me, they're going to deal with my bullshit of me ranting on and complaining about how this website is full of shit. And I'm just going to have to wait till another good site comes up. Anyway, the third strike and the final strike that killed off my fucking YouTube channel. Grand Theft Auto has a website called Hush Smush. If you go on a website and pull up your phone, uh... You can go on the internet, or you can use the laptops on the game. You type in Hush Smush. It's a, a adult dating website on the game. Let me remind you, there is no nudity on this fucking website. In fact, they go through great lengths to cover up a lot of shit. Great lengths. And this is a video game once again. This is a fucking video game. This is not real life shit. This is just a video game. 
This is just shapes in fucking Blender. This is just shapes in AutoCAD and drafted into a fucking three-dimensional figure. X, Y to Z. This is not real shit. This is geometric fucking shapes. Not even nudity in this one. In fact, this video, I don't even really get, the video's not even that long. I don't know what to fucking say, YouTube. I really don't know what to say. Not only that, but I guarantee if you go on YouTube, type in the search bar, type in Grand Theft Auto Hush Mush, there's another guy that has a video showing the adult dating website. But mm, let me see, his video is still up. In fact, his has more views than mine. Wow, isn't that something? YouTube, you done fucked up on your website by letting Google take over. I mean, it's already been a shit website from the fucking beginning, but we've just been going with it because it has a great name. It's a catchy name, YouTube. What the fuck ever, you guys run your website like a shithead. Um, and let me give a rundown pretty much of how my history of YouTube has been. Um, before I, it was a gaming channel, I did have documentaries and blogs, like I said. A lot of shit, you know, that I talked about. I had a lot of memorable shit on that channel for a whole two years, and it's gone. Before that channel, before I started that channel in 2008, I had another YouTube channel, Mr. Glenwood 1. Mr. Glenwood 1 was my early, early years in high school. I was 15 when I started that channel, or 14, whatever. And I was also... It was also just a memorable part of my life. They took that channel down for copyright. Um, copyright of a bunch of music and claims of sexual content, whatever. YouTube, please show me in my videos where the porn is there. Because last time I checked, um, I didn't see any fucking porn in my videos. I don't think you guys actually have people reviewing these videos. I think there's always some random butthurt faggot that's fucking flagging the videos. And you guys go based off of that butthurt faggot. And just say, oh, well, that's another flag. Let's take down this channel. Oh, he's a homophobe. Let's take down this channel. Motherfucker, did you even watch the fucking video? Where in the hell did I say I was a homophobe or I hated gay people? I said if you're gay, that's your choice. That's cool with me. Don't fucking, don't fucking put words in my mouth. I, I clearly stated in the video that gay people, I have no problem with you. Gay people are cool. Oh, nope, he's a homophobe. Hate speech. What the fuck is wrong with you guys? If anything, the Duck Dynasty ass show, asshole should be fucking removed from the internet. He has the biggest fucking bigoted hate speech all over. Remove his shit off the fucking internet. Remove him off the fucking internet. You want to remove me off the fucking internet and take my channel down? Take Duck Dynasty, that asshole, off the fucking internet. This is just BS. YouTube. Your website sucks. When something else comes up and takes over within the next five years and you're no longer considered the next biggest thing, you'll be the new fucking MySpace. You'll be sitting along with Tom in his white fucking t-shirt next to his laptop. No, not even a laptop. A desk fucking top. That fat piece of shit desktop. With your thumbs up, smiling back, saying, Oh, it looks like I'm no longer a part of the fucking internet. Oh well, goodbye internet, you'll be part of fucking Tom. Remember that shit? Remember all you old school MySpace users with Tom and his fucking white t-shirt, thumbs up, looking back at us? Yeah, you're gonna be fucking associated with Tom if you don't get your shit together. I don't know what the fuck else to say, people. This is my second YouTube channel with historical memories that I had on my channel. Going over B.S. I've been with YouTube since the beginning, since 2005, 2006, whatever. It's been BS. This is going to be my next gaming channel. Um, hopefully this one doesn't get taken out for BS. I had over 1,300 subscribers going on 1,400. And honestly, the bad part about this is... My subscribers were starting to actually watch my shit. And now it's gone. Great fucking job, YouTube.
great fucking job. Meanwhile, this, this weird ass gameplay in the background was some hackers or something that was invisible. I know it's weird to watch, but great fucking job, YouTube. You really know how to represent the internet community by just completely banning people off of your site for hate speech and porn, apparently. Where is this porn? Well, we don't have any evidence of it, but we're just going to remove you. Oh, okay. What the fuck does that say about your community? What does that say about the people that review your videos? It says you're assholes. Fuck you guys.